going on to you leo so um you have the three of cups the magician the hierophant the knight of pentacles page of cups four of wands the nine of swords the chariot the seven of wands and the eight of swords so um uh okay Okay. Uh, I honest, I, I see. Uh, I honestly see that you, you Leo, is a kind of. Uh, <laughs> how how do I even explain this? Right, the 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 three of cups, the magician, the hierophant, the knight of pentacles, the page of cups. A lot of you Leos are just kind of looking over the dating landscape. You know, the overall idea of what dating is about. And a lot of you Leos are like, yo, this is really stupid. Like a lot of you, <laughs> because the Three of Cups and the Magician, right, is really about how you Leos are having so much fun doing you, right? Whether you're in a relationship, being in one, or whether you're single, being in one, right? regardless of whether you have somebody or you or you don't you're right and i <laughs> and and the hierophant is about ultimately finding that peace right like if you're single you're like you don't understand why you would get into one a dysfunctional one if you're with someone that and it works a lot of you leos are like yo other people need to try being <laughs> a, you know try being in a relationship but either way it goes, it's, it's this overall view of this landscape, right? Of how people interact. And the Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Cups represents, you just see it like specifically the single ones, single Leos, you Leos see it like it's just backwards. Because it's the sense that people won't attention from you but they're just they're they're not as i was talking about earlier today they're just not in control of their own emotions they're just not right off off camera off screen they're just not in control of their emotions right you know kind of like with virgo as i was talking about the confusion right the idea that people say that they really want something and then when they get it it's like they're running away and they can't deal with it and the, the the delusion and they say and what it is that they want and what it is that they said that they want doesn't make sense and it's this type of situation for you leos it doesn't make any sense and a lot of you leos are like people can say a lot of what it is that they want but the way that it actually plays out it seems to you, Leos, like people are like this, worshiping fish. You know what I mean? Like, you know, they're, they're more so worshiping fish in the sense of like, they're playing games and, and, and they, they want all this attention from you, Leos, but it's, it, it just seems like it's not a lot of seriousness happening here where people are do, practicing what they preaching, right? It, it's, it's more so a sense of people are only into the chase of it. And then once you're caught, now it's like you're not intriguing. There's no mystery to it anymore. And the Four of Wands represents, this speaks to the dichotomy of what it is that a lot of you Leos want. You want to be caught and the person be happy at the fact that they caught you and appreciate you. But it you know the nine of swords you may be, some of you leos may be discouraged because it's like what's the sense a lot of you leos are thinking what's the point <clears throat> of interacting with 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 people when they are delusional like this and they're dysfunctional the chariot here they are trying to they you know and and just kind of 
a lot of you Leos are just kind of telling yourselves why, right? It's the sense that, you know, you, you're like people who act like they want something. It sounds so shallow. Everyone acts like all they want is money and, and, and looks, right? It's all about money and looks. They, they come into an interaction with someone not even knowing how to socialize. Soon as you meet somebody and you're getting to know them, right? Soon as you meet somebody, you have that gold digger, that, that gold digger sign. Soon as you meet somebody, you're only going to be hanging out with this person because this person has a has a has a nice butt or something like this. Or the person may be very pretty in the face or, or you know, may have, uh, you know, a, a very beautiful body or something like this. And it's like this, and for you, it's like, you know, there's no sincerity there anymore. This is what y'all are thinking to yourselves. Right. And the Seven of Wands and the Eight of Swords is about how. And a lot of you Leos are thinking about this as you are spending some of that alone time to yourselves. Like, what's the point? And the point is, right? The point is, is for you to. It, the point is this, right? The point is. If you know you can't really be single, right, for a long period of time, like long periods of time, if you know that you want that support system around you, because not everybody is built the same. So if you know that you want that support system around you, and there's nothing wrong with trying to date, but be very wise about how it is that you go about doing it, right? Some people are freaks of nature, like myself, where I can take it or leave relationships. I, you know, whatever. But if you Leos know you want to be in one, the point is to be getting to know someone that would cherish you instead of trying to tear you down and trying to sabotage you, right? As well as building that community. The community starts in the home. You create a community, right? With the two parents and the, the, the offspring, right? So if you Leos know good and well that you want that community, that's the point in which you are dating. You're dating for that community because you want to belong. You want, you want other people that you created, right? Being the parent of, to belong and to, to propel yourselves as well as themselves uniquely into the next generation to be proud of that, right? Be a, a, a lion pride, right? Because a group of lions is called a pride. But the thing about it is, is that this is why it is that you date. But a lot of you Leos need to keep that in mind though. Otherwise you will get discouraged as you may have been for a couple of days and you will ask yourselves like, what is the point? And there's nothing wrong with asking yourself that. But what is wrong is getting lost in the sauce know why it is that you date know why it is that you are single know both of those things so let's clarify some of these cards let's clarify the chariot you have the temperance the fool the world the ace of cups the temperance and the fool to clarify the chariot it's all about the, you understanding why it is that you stopped hanging out with so many people in the first place and you started talking to people fewer and far in between, right? You stopped talking to people so much because you because some of you Leo saw it like it, all it was is people are just looking to see how much it is that they would get paid at the end of the month, right? They're looking at love the way that they look at as a as a job interview or working a job, right? in the sense that in the, in, the, in the element of they're looking at the paycheck they're not necessarily really enjoying the fact that they are in a relationship with somebody that understands them they're looking to get paid they're look they're waiting for their paycheck right and the world and the and the ace of cups is about how and that's what got you to to start being lone wolves, so to speak, by yourselves or rogue lions in the first place. 
So now you Leos understand the world, the Ace of Cups, your perspective on love is still changing, which is good because it means that you're still growing. You're supposed to change, right? And what it is that you're changing, the, your perspective on love is changing into a more realistic perspective in the sense that you, you, you are starting to, that questioning of your meaning of why it is that you date is starting to create the meaning of why it is that you date or why you don't date. So the need to ask that question, what is the point, is what's creating the meaning out of it. You're dating because you want to create that pride of lions if you catch my drift. And if people can't give you that, that, that lion pride, then they have to go. Um, that's pretty much it. Comment on the video, like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, share the video. I'm trying to make my YouTube channel grow to 10,000 subscribers by, I don't know, the end of December. I don't know. As of right now, I have 9,000 subscribers. Smash the subscribe button. Uh, smash the subscribe button. Smash that like button. Hit the notification bell. Set that notification bell to all so you can be notified whenever I drop my videos. Also, too, there's a link in the link. There's a link in the comment section called the link tree. Click on it. Uh... It'll take you to a website in which it has all my social media outlets. Definitely go ahead and pick up my merch, okay, at the Teespring store. Jam-packed. I'm, I'm going to make brand new designs, all of that good stuff. Wear it for y'all. Y'all going to see over the past, the next couple of months. Take it easy. Peace.